if you have ever been tasked with crafting a list and then bringing that list over as a report in a specific dashboard within HubSpot and didn't know how to do that, you're in the right place. In this video, I'm going to show you the more streamlined process step by step of how to convert a specific list into a report so that that can be added later on into a specific dashboard. Check this out. To convert a list into a report, I'll go to my contact section and hit lists and then in here i'm going to identify the list that i actually want to turn into a report in this case it is the customers list so i'll hit uh, customers and i do see that this is the data that i actually want to see in a report so now we'll go to reporting i'll go to uh reports my reports and then in here i'm going to create a report at the top right corner i hit create report and then i will choose the custom report builder in this case i will just choose my own data sources and i actually only want to use my contacts uh, as a source so i'll hit next at the top and in here i actually want to choose this table view once i choose that table view i, I will look for the things that i actually want to report on such as record id of contacts perhaps the email and perhaps the let's call it the original source and let's think also about maybe the create date for now that'll be good hubspot allows us to choose from several distinct contact properties to report on and in this case here's where the magic comes in i will go to the filters tab right here and in here um, i'm going to add list membership to it so i will look for list membership on the left side and add it as a field on the right side on the filters Tab, right so in here I'm going to choose list membership and then what I'm going to do is choose select operator is member of list and then I will select the list right so in this case it was the customers list and I will just hit apply and now with just that one filter I am now able to see the five same contacts that were on my list and my list is officially a report right so I will just uh, rename it customers list save my report and I will not add it to a dashboard for now but I'll just hit next and save and you can now see if I go to go to reports right here I actually have the customers list created now as a report that I can look at for decision making purposes that was a pretty quick and easy process now keep in mind that HubSpot does have a couple other functionalities that could also aid in crafting this report from scratch one of them is going into the list and looking at the use in uh, tab right there which is really a button and then if you click on it one of the options is going to be to open that in the custom report builder however by default you may be seeing a report that is count of contacts by lifecycle stage which then later you'll have to still adjust to what we just went through in this video remember education is great but the execution is where it's at so go out there and be the hub hero that your organization needs today